Hi everybody, it's Julia, your trusted travel expert from Mathis and & Travel, and I'm coming to you today from Club Med Punta Cana, uh, and I wanted to take this moment to give you a little bit of information not only on this particular resort, but also on Club Med in general. And so I am in what is known as the Zen Oasis section, and that's this beautiful adults only section of Club Band Puticana. And um, that's the first thing I wanted to let you know is that almost all club meds have a very strong family focus. Um, there are a few that don't really have kids programs and there are I think a few that are adults only, but what they do is they sort of take the resorts and like this one they've added this adults only section. So this pool, which is gorgeous, is um, adults only. The, you know, and they actually do stop, you know, 18, you know, people who are under 18 from going and they help with these little armbands that you wear and it's super quiet and super relaxing. And then I'm going to just shift over a little bit. That is the bar that's right there. It's not swim up bar, but it's just right there by the pool and it's got snacks all day and they play some like super cool chill music and it's just a really nice section. Now, to show you how far this adults only section is from the main section is all I have to do is shift there. And between the two casitas that you can see, um, that is the building for the standard rooms. So, um, you know, those families could be staying in there, but they just can't come in this section. And then right in front of there, um, you get to the beach. And also on the beach, there is an adults only section and there is, um, that's over here on, on this end. And then there's just a huge swath of beach where you've got all the sports, um, you have a couple restaurants, you have um, then the big main part of the beach uh, with all these palm trees everywhere, um, the, where they had like they had music and a barbecue one day, and they have games, they have bocce ball, volleyball courts. Um, the big main pool is right next to the beach, um, and so it's just it's really big um, and it's really cool. And in between here and all there is the Creative, and that's where the where they've worked with Cirque du Soleil. Um, and created this, I mean, it's circus school, and they have circus school at lots of different club meds, but here at Punta Cana is the first one where they've had one that's actually created by and designed by Cirque du Soleil. Um, and so it's super cool. We got to experience it a little bit yesterday, um, and it was so fun. I swung on a tra trapeze, which is way harder than it looks, um, but there's also, you know, trampolining, there's um, the scarf, uh, I don't know, dancing, scarf exercises, there's... Um, Lots of stuff with bungee cords and you know juggling and all kinds of good stuff. It's really, really cool. And they divide that up by ages, so kids can be doing it at certain times of the day, or adults can be doing it at other times of the day. Um, it's super cool. And then beyond all of that stuff is the kids' club, where the smaller kids go and they have their own little pools with um, you know lots of like fun water slidey things and water toys and stuff like that. Um, and they also have like, you know, nap rooms, relaxation rooms. Um, they also have a really cool room for parents to be able to access baby food, like three, you know, all 24 hours a day. So if you need juice boxes or formula or whatever it is, um, parents have a key to access that room, which is great. And then beyond all of that, the resort is huge. They have what the, is their, their five trident area and that's sort of kind of like Zen Oasis that's its own sort of mini boutique hotel you could say in the middle of uh, Club Med and that is I think only there are 32 suites and they're really five star they're even bigger I mean my room is huge here in Zen Oasis um, and in some of the rooms the standard rooms are really big too you can fit up to a family of five in them but the suites are, are you know just extra spacious gorgeous they have their own really cool infinity pool right on the water it's not right on a beach because the 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 land is a little bit cliffy there it's a little bit rocky so they just stuck an infinity pool right in there and it's just for those 32 rooms um, and they also have room service and and that's really the five-star experience within club Club Med Punta Cana and that's sort of the way Club Med is going in general. It's no longer the sort of hippie dippy camp for you know adults kind of a thing. It's not at all. Apparently 70% of their clients are families so almost all resorts are family oriented like I said um, but then they have little sections that are either um, higher higher uh, class, higher quality, like the five trident section, or like this, they have the adult only section. Um, so it's a really great place for, um, like if you're doing groups, if you're doing, you know, uh, like a family reunion or a big group of people that have, you know, some have kids, some don't, 
um, you know, some, you know, maybe like the 32 rooms, I mean, that could be, you could run out the whole entire space, which they've had done before, which is really cool. And then there are all kinds of activities for everybody to do from sailing and scuba diving and kayaking and snorkeling, uh, to volleyball and creative stuff. And they have shows at night. I mean, there's just always stuff going on. Um, and that was one thing I did want to say about diving. And about the beach, you know, I think I kind of gave you an impression of how long it is. Club Med was usually one of the first to come in to a lot of these islands that they belong to. So they have really kind of super advantageous uh, locations wherever they are. Like, it's not just they have one skinny beach here. They have, you know, freaking, I don't even know, maybe it's a kilometer of beach or of beachfront property. I don't know. It's too, it's big. It's really big. <laughs> and so they have space to spread everything out from the adult only beach. It's really quiet next to the spa all the way down, um, through the, the kind of busy beach in the center, that down to that five trident area, which again is a little more exclusive. Um, and right in front. And the other great thing, because Punta Cana is apparently notoriously very difficult to have swimming beaches, this part of the property or this part of, of Punta Cana is protected. They have a reef right out front. There's actually like a shipwreck right out front of, um, of the, like the restaurants here, um, the beach here. And so you can not only swim all over the beach, you can also grab snorkeling gear and snorkel right off the beach. I mean, my dive that I did was, I mean, the, we rode on the boat for five minutes just out to the reef to a special part of the reef and that's where we did our dive and there's tons of different dive sites up and down um, and but if you're not a diver there are also those you can snorkel over those sites and the reef you know comes pretty high so it's amazing snorkeling just right off of the water so you know like I said Club Med has really changed a lot and um, it's been a really great uh, great visit it is a very European experience it's a Europe it's a French company and so you know all of the people staff here I've been confused about what language to speak they speak Spanish Spanish, English and French here um, and I think most everywhere you go they speak French and English and the the native language uh, so it's something very different um, and really cool I will say that the dining I'll talk a little bit about the dining uh, it is not your typical dining I experience mostly there are three restaurants here two of which are buffet and one of which is sit down and it's right on the beach it's beautiful uh, the buffets are huge and they're really nice it's not like oh I'm gonna go dig out some you know slop and put it on my plate no you walk up and you look through the different stations and oh this tonight I'll have yeah I'll try the, the whole fish with mashed you know sweet potato and, and fresh vegetables that the chef is just sauteing and they hand you a composed plate that is beautiful I mean they, they make them really nice looking and so it's it's really not your typical buffet um, they also have amazing bread because again French company and they have this amazing white chocolate bread that is to die for I've had way too much of it um, and uh, and you know they have wine and beer and all that good stuff and you know drinks at the bar whenever you need them so uh, they don't have a lot of snacking like 24 hours a day there's not food in your mini bar or anything like that so that's something a little bit different that Americans might want to be aware of um, and also the fact that it's not all Americans. I mean all sorts of languages are being spoken by the guests around here It's it's really I really like it. It really appeals to me So but some people might be thrown off by that or something like that or I don't know So I just wanted to kind of give you a little picture of Club Med and hopefully uh, I've intrigued you and you're you're interested in seeing more. So that's it for this week. I'll talk to you next week. Bye-bye